So many of you have reached out asking about the gated communities in and around Plantation. Now, some people absolutely do not want any sort of a gated community or anything that has an association. And there are other people that absolutely want gated communities. They like the security, they like the amenities. So today we're gonna to look at some of the most popular gated communities in and around the Plantation area so you can get a very good idea of what you can get in those communities and we're gonna get started right now so stay tuned all right so welcome to the channel guys and we're talking gated communities and we have to start off at hawks landing in plantation which has to be one of the most sought after gated communities in the entire area Now, a lot of people would say this is where the rich people live in Plantation, but that's not entirely true. There's a lot of areas in Plantation that have very high priced homes that are not gated, Plantation Acres, Old Plantation, uh, areas where you get these big, huge estates on multi-acre lots, equestrian areas. But as far as the gated communities with great amenities, Hawks Landing absolutely has to be top of the list. So Hawks Landing is a luxury gated community located directly in the center of plantation. Now the development is quite large. It takes up about 1.6 mile uh, circumference or radius. It sits between Knob Hill Road, Broward Boulevard, Hiatus, and also State Road 84. Now Hawks Landing is known for its beautiful landscape, its uh, incredible luxury custom homes, and world-class amenities. Now at the center of the development Hawks Landing is a Hawks Landing Club. Now this is a $15 million Mediterranean complex that really makes this development almost like its own little community and neighborhood. Now the clubhouse features a uh, billiard room, a card room, chess. Now the outdoor amenities include tennis, pickleball, basketball, an incredible lagoon shaped pool and jacuzzi. And it's really just a beautiful community. It's ideal for jogging and walking. And again, the landscaping in Hawks Landing is just world class. There's also a fitness center and just absolutely amazing amenities. Now the development of Hawks Landing contains 540 single family homes. Most of them are waterfront and they range in size between three and six bedrooms, 2,600 to about 6,000 square feet. And prices range from about 1 million up to and above $3 million. Now association fees uh, for Hawks Landing are $27.50 per quarter. So next up on the list guys is Plantation Palms. Now Plantation Palms is another beautiful single family home community. This is in the Jacaranda area of Plantation. It's within walking distance of Central Park. And this is another area of Plantation with beautiful manicured lawns, tree-lined streets, and just tons of curb appeal. Now Plantation Palms is another community with very large lakefront homes. So uh, great for families that need a lot of space. So these luxury homes and plantation feature stunning kitchens, mostly with granite countertops, custom cabinets, very large pantries, wine coolers, top of the line appliances. So a lot of the models here in Plantation Palms feature uh, Saturnia marble floors with wooden porcelain flooring in the bedrooms, which gives a really elegant look and extends throughout the entire home. Many of the homes also have an additional office space, built-in shelving, formal dining rooms, and incredible lake views from many of the rooms in the home. And of course, the backyard feels like your own private resort with beautiful pools, great landscaping, and incredible views of your lake. Now, the homes and plantation palms were built in the 1990s. They're between four and six bedrooms. They're pretty large, going from about 3,000 to 5,000 square feet, and they range in price from about 1 million up to $2 million. Now the homeowners association fees here in Plantation Palms are a lot less than Hawks Landing. Comes in at $4.95 per month, but it does not have the amenities. It's really just for the security and maintaining the common area. Now next, we're gonna head over to a neighboring town of Plantation called Davie to a community and development called Emerald Springs. 
So the community of Emerald Springs Estates is the first of the two Emerald community builds here in Davie. So this is the sister community to the Emerald Isle Estates, which butts up directly to it, only separated by an easement. So there are eight different models of homes in Emerald Estates, but there's 20 variations of each model, and they're all identified by their names, which are in the themes of precious stones like ruby, sapphire, topaz, and pearl. Now the builder at the time was one of the most flexible and creative builders in Davy. Not only did they offer a lot of different versions of the same model, but they would alter the floor plan based on the buyer's needs. Now this could be anything really like um, extended rooms or higher entry garages, anything based on the buyer's wants and needs. Now again, this was virtually unheard of at the time in Davy, where you just had your standard floor plan and there was really no way to modify it and change any of the room dimensions. So homes in Emerald Estates were developed between 1990 and 2004. Now there's only 74 homes total in both the sister communities and they don't come up for sale very often. So the homes in Emerald Estates are between four and eight bedrooms and they range in size from about 2,800 square feet all the way up to 5,400 square feet and they range in price from 900,000 to about two million dollars. Now association fees are quite low here. Uh, they're about 255 per month which is a lot different than the Hawks Landing. There's no amenities though. Uh, they just take care of common area and also you have the gate. So there you have it guys, some of the most desirable gated communities near the plantation area. I hope you got something from this video. If you have any questions about any of these developments or looking to buy a house, relocate, or even sell a house anywhere here in South Florida, I would love to be your real estate resource of choice. All you got to do is reach out to me at the information below and I'd love to talk to you and help you with your real estate needs. And I'll see you all on the next video. Thank you so much for watching.